Um, does he gotta make a certain amount of money? He needs to be wealthy. He needs to be able to take care of himself, his own needs, his own habits. If that looks like he's making six figures a month, then so be it. Wealthy, oh. I would think, is, oh, you said six figures a month. Mm hmm So not six figures a year. So you want to be a millionaire then? Absolutely. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. We've got another Kendra G reaction video that, and you know, I, we're all catching heat from her for doing this, but here we go anyway. She's so spiritual looking. She's got the whole uh, African woke vibe thing happening, but she's materialistic and she's looking for a millionaire. Just a combination I was not expecting to see, I'm sensing a sheep in wolf's clothing. Here we go. Oh, as always, the entire video is pinned to the comment section. Now, here we go. Hello. Hi. Wow. Wow, how are you? That's not a bonnet, right? Or is it a bonnet? No, this is an African giving. Oh, okay, okay. What? Do you wear that all the time? Um, Bro, different what are you colors, talking but about, I do man? wear this to protect my crown. Okay, so you don't show your hair in public? I do. Oh, you So the African Gide, or whatever the <laughs> she called it, is not, it, it has no significance because she does not always wear it. I, okay. Do, okay. I show the hair. hair. Oh, you do my show your hair. hair? I do. Okay, okay. Yeah. What's your name, baby? Ifa Shayo. What? Ooh, say it again. Ifa Shayo. I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to mess it up. Do you have a nickname? <laughs> no, that's just my name. Ifa Okay. Ifa Shayo. I'm a day, yo. I'm a day, yo. Ifa Fa Shayo. Don't look any further, further. No, don't get mm -hmm. mad at me because I know I can't pronounce it. Ifa okay. Shayo, where you calling us from? I'm calling from Atlanta, Georgia. Welcome to Atlanta. How old are you? I am 29. I'll be 30 on Monday. Oh, happy birthday on the way. So you're a cancer. Thank you. I am. Do you have any kids? I do. I have a son. He's 11. 11. What do you do for a living? I am a sound healer, holistic practitioner. So I teach yoga, meditation. I provide holistic healing. Translation, she's unemployed and broke. Okay, holistic healing. Mm -hmm. And what's your birth? Oh, you're a cancer. So, mm -hmm. holistic healing. So, this is Ifa Shaho? Shayo. <laughs> Ifa Shayo. I'm sorry, girl. Yeah, She's in Atlanta, okay. 29, a cancer, has an 11 year old son, is a holistic healer. What kind of man do you desire? Um, I desire an African man or one of African culture or background. Um, someone that is honest, someone that is definitely masculine, a king, someone that knows who he is, knows his life purpose, his mission in life, and is after that. Okay. What's some deal breakers for you? Liars. Hey, you ain't got um, to lie. People that are not motivated. People that... Wait, what did Miss Having No Shop say? Um, people that are not motivated. Wow, she really said that. Mm, let me think on that. Those two for sure, but definitely people that have like multiple children and, and big mama issues. I'm beyond drama free, so I don't deal with any of that. Okay, no big mama issues. Does he have to be in Atlanta? No, he doesn't have to be in Atlanta. If he's not in Atlanta, he has to like have business here, have something here that's Bringing them back and forth. Okay, bringing them back and forth. All right, can he have kids? He can have kids. Okay, have you ever been married? I haven't. Engaged twice, you... but not married. He said engaged twice? Mm-hmm. Black women are so absolutely satisfied with not winning. Black women are the only women who brag about being engaged, but not married. It's crazy. Why don't you settle down with your son's dad? Great question, Kendra G. 
So he just wasn't ready to settle. I thought he was at one point, and I seen that he was still, you know, wanting to live his life like a young, like a young man. So I let him do that instead of trying to tie him into something long and something committed. Well, aren't you, little Miss Magnanimous? You let him be free because he was not ready. Well. Didn't you know he was not ready before having a child with him? It would have made much more sense to let him go and be so magnanimous with his freedom before being tied down with his seed. Okay. I just, you know, let it be. Ifa Shaiho. 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 <laughs> She's in Atlanta, 29. What's the age range you want to date? Um... I would say between 35 and 45. I'm sorry. 35 to 45. Um, mm -hmm. Does he have to look a certain way? Yeah, he needs to be melanated. He needs to be taller than me. I'm 5'8", so taller than me will be perfect. He needs to have straight, good teeth, good hygiene. Like, you know, the normal stuff. <laughs> okay, I'm adding the Kendra G cam to it. So take the camera so we can see your full body. Go up from the top. Okay, okay. Do you have on a robe? No. Now I feel like I gotta show y'all. <laughs> okay, so no, this is a dress. Okay. Um, okay. I don't be, you know, out here with skimpy on, excuse me, but I wear flowy things. Okay, okay. Yeah. All right. Um, does he gotta make a certain amount of money? He needs to be wealthy. He needs to be able to take care of himself, his own needs, his own habits. If that looks like he's making six figures a month, then so. Uh, no way did I hear that correctly. No way did this 30 year old baby mama say six figures a month. Hold on. He needs to be able to take care of himself, his own needs, his own habits. If that looks like he's making six figures a month, then so be it. And the way she just to let that casually roll off of her tongue like she deals with millionaires all day, every day, but never been more than engaged. Okay. Wealthy, I would think, is, oh, you said six figures a month. Mm hmm What? So not six figures a year. Bro, so what are you talking about, man? Absolutely. Or somewhere that, not even like you have to be a millionaire to date me. I just want the man to be wealthy and well off. <laughs> what is she saying? The very lowest tier of wealthy is millionaire. That's the lowest tier. <laughs> My God. You know, not scamming. You know, have your own thing going on. You Do you know? normally date wealthy men? I would say that I date men that value, that have good things going for themselves. So why haven't any of those relationships worked out? How come they haven't worked out? Yes. Well, people have their own things that outside of me and what I can control, there's different things that happen where why, why things don't align. Rather, it's just not in alignment for certain areas that I'm looking for or even for them. It's not even always on the other person or why things don't work out. So I can't point the finger and say, I know exactly why this didn't work with this person. I know exactly why this didn't work out here. Good Lord. Say less, much less. Well, it's hard to say less. Yes, she said a lot of words, but she said nothing. In other words, she's taken no accountability. Relationships, and she said multiple, have ended, and she had no idea why. She seemed a little off from the start. Now she really seems off. Right. Things just weren't in alignment. I feel like where maybe at one point of time it was in alignment. And just wasn't. And just wasn't. Now everybody wants to know how much money you make. You don't necessarily have to answer that question. That's none of their business. <laughs> and there you have it. And we're going to leave it there. Like I said earlier, the entire video is pinned to the comments section. I said it early and at the beginning basically this is just a wolf in sheep's clothing she's just cosplaying a traditional woman she has the look of a traditional woman she speaks softly she has the feminine 
mannerisms down. That I'll give her. But 30-year-old baby mamas are not what millionaires are looking for. I'm quite sure her baby daddy was not a millionaire or she would have said it. So she's got an 11-year-old child. She's 30. She's in the danger zone. Now she just wants to lay back, take it easy, and have a man do that for her. Ma'am, you're not what they're looking for. Until next time, that's it. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Also, hit that notification bell so that you know when the next videos are posted.